hi friends welcome to horse racing 91 youtube channel today you are going to see a new solvers tutorial for beginners is that about circular pattern feature too so here i am going to show you by creating a flange of uh, diameter outer diameter 60 mm and inner diameter 30 mm and uh, having a pcd of 45 mm okay let's see how to apply circular pattern feature to for that you have to create a part first so i'm going to create a part file here i am selecting a top plane for just for an example you can select any planes for the right top as as you need Okay, here I am select top plane and I'm going to create a circle of circle and also another circle inside it. Okay, I'm going to smart dimension it. It's diameter. I'm going to give you a 60 mm. Uh, this one. one is 30 mm inside diameter is 30 mm and outside diameter is 60 mm okay then exit sketch go to features menu and select the sketch and click on extrude course now I'm giving a total amount thickness to my flange okay here i want to create a hole for my flange uh, the pcd the pitch circle diameter is 15 mm 15 mm away from the center circle okay dimension 15 mm Sorry. The distance is total distance is 15 mm and uh, 7.5 mm away from the inside circle circumference. This is 7.5. Okay. Then here I am going to create my hole on the match of uh, diameter radius of 5 mm okay it's not a standard design specification i'm just showing an example how to use this circular pattern feature to it's all works okay so okay i'm going to delete Okay, which uh, one pattern? So you can select and delete it. It's all okay. So keep it here, like it, read sketch, and uh, delete. Okay, from insert sketch, you can delete it. Then exit sketch, sketch, select the sketch to and you can also create hole by cutting the feature that is use extrude cut on surface blind cut okay total of cut okay yeah here you create a hole over here and then another thing is that for applying the circular pattern you need to create a access over it for that go to reference geometry and click on access and select the face reference entity here i am clicking the reference entity and uh, the access will be parallel to this reference entity okay cylindrical or conical surface where axis is my axis. I click 
create an axis okay the second thing is that okay created an axis then go to the linear pattern feature the pattern features and select the circular pattern here first you have to select the axis of the pattern then here how to select the degree as you know right click 60 degree and numbers of force is 6 and spacing equally spacing oh, 60 minutes is already in the space okay and uh, features to pattern is my context to see did you see that and uh, faces to pattern no, to, no need to select this faces to pattern to click ok yeah here I made a flange having six holes by using the circular pattern ok friends I think you guys got idea about the circular, how to apply circular pattern here you can also edit the circular pattern by clicking over it if you click on the equal spacing and also it will equally space it's already equally spaced then you can you cannot see the changes okay you can also apply spaces to pattern if you want to patternize a space you can also do that by clicking over here uh, okay friends that's it hope you I should be this preview options less just like other properties okay okay friends this is what how to use our supply pattern feature doing so works and uh, I think you guys learned this feature well if you have any doubts comment me and if you like my videos subscribe to my channel horse is a 91 okay bye bye friends Ta da